I want to show you how to deposit items to a stockpile. This will allow you to share items with other regiment members and stop other people outside the regiment from taking them without permission. This can be done at a seaport, which appears on the map at this icon and will always be on the coast, or a storage depot, which appears on the map at this icon over here and will often be inland. The process is the same regardless of which location you're at. To deposit items, they will need to be in a crate and can't have been taken from a public stockpile. Normally this will be because you have just made them at the factory, however if you wish to deposit resources you will need to take them out of the refinery using the retrieve as crates option or you will not be able to deposit them. If you have done this correctly they will be marked as reservable uh, as you can see here. If they don't have this mark they can't be deposited which is usually because these are goods you didn't produce yourself or you accidentally submitted them to a public stockpile. When you enter the stockpile, you'll see the public stockpile and we'll have to select the correct stockpile from the drop down menu in the upper right. If this is your first time accessing the stockpile, it will not be visible here and you'll need to enter a code to gain access. Select the enter a passcode option and type in the box that's provided the six digit passcode given by your offices or logistics. This is what you'll see once you gained access to a stockpile. This one is empty, but there will normally be items submitted by other regiment members here. Please keep the passcode to the stockpile secret and take only what you need or have permission to take, as these items will often be used in operations for the benefit of the regiment. To submit a crate from your inventory, make sure the correct private stockpile is selected and the crate is reservable. If you submit to the wrong stockpile, your crates will no longer be reservable, so be very careful. Right click it and select submit to stockpile when you're ready. Uh, there are also some other methods for submitting different items such as shipping containers or vehicles which are present in the actions tab at the bottom of the screen. However, you don't need to worry about these for now. There are a number of different types of items that can be submitted, particularly crates from the factory, crates of resources from the refinery, non-combat vehicles, crates of combat vehicles and even ships, although to submit a ship you must be at a seaport and not a storage depot. You may want to go through the vehicles present in this screen yourself to try and get a feel for what can and can't be submitted. Some captured vehicles can also be submitted, so if you do need to store any of these, be aware that that is an option. When you want to remove an item from a stockpile, right click it in the stockpile and click retrieve. An animation will play and the item will be delivered into your inventory, into the loading area in front of the stockpile or into the water nearby depending on the item's size and purpose. 